Hey everyone, here I got a uh, really special base made by a Federa uh, custom model um, that you actually probably won't see much anywhere on the internet uh, at all. Um, Anthony Jackson uh, shape. Um, it's, it's an elite style model, so it's very much like an Imperial um, with really nice uh, Bubinga stringers we got here and technically like a, a five-piece neck going on, maple center and sides. Um, awesome alder tone block with a mahogany body. So you get the nice fender style warmth. I love uh, Federa uses tone blocks because it, uh, you get to maintain the um, overall tonal palette is basically driven by the tone block. Um, so when you want to change and mix and match different uh, tones, you just change your body type um, and you can get a really different sound. Because if this was all mahogany, um, if the mahogany entire body or with the tone block as well, um, it has a very specific sound overall. But when you throw in um, alder, it gives it a bit more fender flair. Uh, so fretboard is uh, Palferro. Um, Palfero is, uh, at least what Federa uses, is actually pretty decent stuff. Um, they use a lot in their, uh, their, their uh, standard models. Um, but I really do like it on this base. The Palfero with the alder tone block and mahogany uh, make it sound great. The other thing too, with a maple top on a mahogany body is a really good option. It's something they use with Les Pauls, but in the world of bases, I dig it. Not everyone does, but I find it's great. It's got a very nice uh, tone though in general. I've got it right now in passive mode, um, in single coil with uh, my um, uh, center detent uh, for the pickups, so basically the blend, um, right straight up down the middle, so shared for both pickups. I've got volume on full, I got my passive tone on full, so. <laughs> Deadly B string with 36 inch scale. And I've got this hooked up to my Bergantino B amp with uh, my two NV 115s. They sound awesome together. They're stacked uh, horizontally. I really, they're one of my favorite uh, combinations with the B amp. passive. If I flip it to active, I did one thing because inside the control cavity um, on a Federa you can actually increase the output gain on uh, the active preamp setting. So this one I turned it up a bit just because it provides a better fuller sound for this bass. <laughs> fenders you'd ever hear uh, and it's and it's very smooth um, I think that that's attributed to the uh, neck through body design it's awesome inch like I specifically don't feel I have huge hands they're probably a little bigger than they're definitely not small um, but I even find where the bridge placement is it's not like it's deep within the body so you're not way out you know does it feel different yeah sure it does I mean comparison to a four string this thing is actually a monster um, 28 frets too this is signified or called a contrabass. Um, anyway, that if you think of the Anthony Jackson presentation model, this is the same um, shape. Uh, the only thing is it's maybe not nearly as thick because on uh, Anthony's model, it's uh, actually carved and hollow. But what he has is a single uh, dual coil pickup, kind of like in the P-Bass 
position, I believe. Um, he works with Ferrera every time with tuning that stuff. And actually, I think even when you get that instrument, uh, Anthony Jackson himself plays, tunes the bass and everything. It's pretty wild. But that's a very expensive instrument. And this one is solid body with the standard versatile position. Um, the pickups, this is 60s, I believe, for where the uh, back pickup is. Cool. So anyway, if you want to hear the variation, there's your back pickup. It's in single coil, so we've got hum. staring at pictures um, yeah it's uh, it's very nice if you look at the weight it is 11.6 uh, pounds the beauty is though you get a nice strap like this good four inch width I have no problem actually when it's hanging on a on a strap this is a Levi strap that I got they, I think they used to call them weight reducing straps but it's not really a weight reducing strap it's basically it helps support it better on your shoulder you don't end up with a problem uh, long term anyways thanks for watching bye for now mm -hmm.